So it seems to me that Sony are being very eager beavers this year, with the fact that they have already given us a preview of their new upcoming 2021 televisions prior to CES 2021, which kicks off next week. The interesting thing about these new TVs though is that they're sporting Sony's new cognitive intelligence AI, which is claimed to be a world first. The four televisions in question right now, which fall under the Bravia XR badge, is the 8K Master Series Z9J LED television, the A90J, the A80J OLED, and the X95J and X90J, which are both 4K LED TVs. Each TV in the new Sony Bravia XR lineup will feature their new cognitive intelligence features, as well as Google TV for all your entertainment needs. And speaking of entertainment, Sony is also including HDMI 2.1 across the entire range, which will cover your all-important gaming at 120Hz, as well as variable refresh rates and auto low latency mode. Google TV also comes with voice controls so you can speak directly to your television set and give it your instructions like you do with your phone or Google Home setup. The television lineup also features Bravia Core, a streaming service that can promise to deliver near lossless UHD Blu-ray quality video thanks to its pure stream technology and an array of titles from Sony's SPE Premium and Classic titles and the largest IMAX enhanced collection. Sound from Picture Reality offers better quality audio and there's also a Netflix enhanced mode too which promises to improve picture quality and audio quality. So you're probably thinking right now, what is cognitive intelligence? Well, it's essentially a way of giving users a much better picture quality from upscaled sources. The cognitive intelligence divides the screen into several zones and detects where the focal point of that scene is within the actual picture itself. So for example, if two people are having a conversation with a scene, it will adjust the image to produce a greater detail as possible in those actors and then separately adjust the image of the background too, as if the TV can detect zones rather than a blanket upscaling of the entire image all at once. Now, of course, we've not seen this in action, seeing as we're all in lockdown and unable to attend a physical CES event, but still, it does sound pretty promising. This also follows suit with the sound, as the cognitive intelligence is able to upscale the original sound of a source to 3D sound, giving users a better placement of objects within a scene playing out. Masao Miando, head of Sony Europe's TV business unit, said that Sony's intent is to constantly innovate in the TV technology, to offer the most immersive viewing experience possible. The new Bravia XR TVs convey reality better than ever thanks to the processing power of the world's first cognitive processor, which goes beyond conventional AI. So the actual cognitive processor itself and the technology in a Sony Bravia Tele is claimed to be a world's first. So where does this all start? Well, the Master Series Z9J comes in an 85 and 75 inch model, and it looks absolutely beautiful. And Sony really know how to put together a great looking TV. As I said before, this is Sony's flagship model and features an 8K image quality from a full array LED panel. Sony also offer their X wide tech for better viewing angles and their XR contrast booster, booster to really bring out the details in all of the shadow and highlights that they can. Now this is Sony's flagship, right? So it's definitely promising to be an absolutely best in class telly and we cannot wait to find out more about this promising panel. Step down from that though and you're greeted with the X95J and X90J which pretty much feature all of the above but have 4K panels and come in a larger array of sizes from 50 right up to 85 inches. Now where Sony are really exciting this year is their inclusion of OLED panels in their brand new lineup which promise to feature a huge improved contrast with their XR OLED contrast tech which adjusts the brightness on the fly to handle glare and deeper black levels and it also features XR motion clarity which minimizes blur with images especially towards the brighter end of the scale. Again you have Bravia Core, HDMI 2.1 and all of that good stuff already mentioned above. The two OLED panels start at 55 inch and the larger model goes all the way up to 83 inches as well, which in itself is a massive achievement to go alongside the smaller sizes. And also there's very little bezel from the images we've seen in Sony's press materials, so there is that too. Now, unfortunately, we've got no prices in Europe as of yet, so I can't give you an idea of how much these televisions are going to be, but it's easy to think that looking at their impressive specs, 
you better start getting your wallets ready because they're going to be empty anytime soon. So thank you very much for checking out our CES 2021 coverage. If you did enjoy this video, hit that like button. Please subscribe to keep up with the rest of the announcements that are coming over next week. And also leave a comment in the comments down below just to let us know what you think about Sony's new lineup and whether you're going to jump on that bandwagon as soon as they come to market. Let us know in the comments below. Subscribe to keep up with the rest of our CES 2021 content and we will see you in the next video.